My mother lives for Christmas. This is her life, my mother. She goes crazy. Does your mother do this? She decorates everything in the house with the Santa Claus toilet seat cover and the ho-ho toilet paper. Ho-ho for your ho-ho. I think that's adorable. <laughs> but here's the weird part. The first day of Advent, she sets out the manger scene. And she sets out all of the pieces of the manger scene except for the baby Jesus. She hides the baby Jesus somewhere in our home. And at midnight, December 24th, begins the hunt for Jesus. And we dig apart my parents' house, kicking and screaming, and actually forked my sister in the butt to find him. Because we desperately want to win the prize. Do you know what the prize is? You get to put the baby Jesus in the manger. Yes! And it's desperate that we get him situated as quick as possible. Because until he's in the manger, we cannot eat the baby Jesus' birthday cake. My mother has the same cake every year. It's an angel food cake with Cool Whip frosting and M&M's. I'm sure he's thrilled. And then she scurries around the house to find as many candles as possible, as close to 2,000, and lights them. And we have to wait 10 minutes to blow them out for the never happening occurrence while Jesus actually will come himself and blow them out. Now, I don't care how religious you are, when you're a grown adult standing in a semicircle around a coffee table and there's a cake with lit candles on it with preservatives and melted wax and you're singing, Happy birthday, dear Jesus. <laughs> you can't help but crack it. <laughs> and this is when my mother has a cocktail. My mother's one of these people, she doesn't really drink. She buys that wine in a box with a spigot. <laughs> it's that pink wine that looks like watered-down Pepto-Bismol. And she has one glass of wine and she snaps. She looks at us like she's never seen us before, like all of a sudden her family's been replaced by KGB agents. <laughs> and she walks to the living room and says, you know, someone's been rearranging the ornaments on my tray. <laughs> really, Mom? Why don't you put your underwear on the inside of your clothes now? Okay. <laughs>